Because honestly, like, I don't care the pecking order of any of it. Hmm? I don't care the pecking order of any of it. No. If somehow we can, like, skeet by without Latoya or Kiefer going home, yeah, and I neither think... of us, I don't care what they do. Yeah, but the thing about it is, is if Ty goes up, that means it's going to be Ty and Kiefer on the block. Which means Kiefer, they're, they're going to want to vote Kiefer out. Maybe not the oddballs. They would, not the oddballs. For the, no, odd, I know. for the oddballs, that is a massive target to get out. That is a huge It target. is. I just don't know if she would actually do it, to be honest. I know. I think she would put up Beth. I mean, for us, it would be the better move if they actually did do that and Kiefer stayed because then it still keeps me and Kiefer and Latoya in a decent position in a, in a group, do you know what I mean? Yeah. I think they know we're in a position where our hands are a little tied and we don't have too much control. And that's true. And right now with all the BS going around, as much as I love Kiefer and Latoya, we cannot jeopardize our game right at this moment. No, no, no. At all. <clears throat> and straight up, Vic has made it kind of clear if Latoya comes down, she doesn't want Kiefer going home. And that's the only person that I made a promise with. Who? I think we're good. Uh, I don't know. We're either good or one of us is going up. That's <laughs> literally all it is. We're either good or we're not. Yeah, we're either good or we're not. It's gonna be a smooth week. It's gonna be a rough week. It's gonna be something. <laughs> And I did mean what I said to Keith, like if I go up, I'm not gonna, I'll be like, you guys do what you think's best. Yeah. I think we both got, like I would probably say that, I'd be like, I think we both got ahead. Mm. But right now, Oddballs has the numbers. Yeah. The other side needs us more than we need them right now. And straight up, I don't care the order. If R4 is good and we can get the heat off of us, I don't care. Because here's another thing, even if we're not fully swayed, what is the harm of us being like oddball side where we can kind of look out for Latoya and Kiefer mm -hmm. and focus on the bigger guys? No, no, I got it. And then once those ones are out, oddballs has to split up at some point anyway. really does just suck though because it's like the two people who seem like they're leading the sides neither one of them I fully trust no. some of the people on each side I trust and not in the same position right yeah so it's okay we're okay <laughs> we're good <laughs> we're good man it does almost feel like there's still teams and Jedson's their captain and like Kyle's ours do you know what I mean it can feel like that. Oh, I'm grateful for this walk. I'm just glad everything's opened up again. Yeah. Oh, right. thank God. We just got to pray. 
that we are legit good with Keith and he's not throwing us under the bus. Because I think there is an element of truth to that he did a little bit before. I think there is an element of truth to that. That he did what? Like said our names. I don't know if he said our names with intention. I don't, I don't know if he's ever said mine. To be honest. Yeah. And that's why, that's why, and I don't think, um, and I honestly, just despite what the guys say, Keith, or Rowan, Rowan and Keith, Kyle, despite what they say, because Rohan told me that Latoya said my name. I, I don't honestly, believe that. I don't, I don't believe that. that, and I don't believe, God, like, that Keith would do it. Did so, they say that Keith said her name? Uh, no, I... Actually, maybe they didn't. No, not Kiefer, no. Right? But they did say that Toya had said my name at one point. But I don't believe that. No, that one's for sure false. So, that I don't like. Mm -hmm. And... Because I know... Man, I am Kiefer. actually praying that she puts out that... That lies a lot. Yeah. And her lies... If you didn't know that she was lying, you wouldn't be able to tell. Oh, no. When she lied to me about knowing nothing about her road boat, the, how effortlessly she said it, was kind of like, ooh. <laughs> because I but know the thing that is, that's true. But the thing is with me, I've become close with Kiefer and Latoya as well as you, yeah. obviously. But I am like so torn inside because I think think hey hey like it's you know what i mean like I it, know, it's I know. like as soon as as I'm soon in, as i I'm go to the, the other side it's no. like fuck really no i know this is your room because i'm in it too but just because we're cool with latoya and kiefer doesn't mean we have to be 100 percent loyal to everybody they're loyal to too yeah i know and my loyal to you 1000 percent after that it would definitely be latoya and kiefer from there i can't tell who's bullshitting me yeah well, I'm just going to have to see what she does with the replacements. Yeah. Best case scenario for us is someone on, you know. Yeah, yeah. I would not be the one to Someone on that side because then that way we're kind of not in a predicament because we have no choice but to vote someone on that yes. side. It just depends on but the we target. We have got to stay true to oddballs right now to some degree because if it's us, we still have the numbers. Do you know what I mean? But I don't think it will be. I, I kind of trust her when she says, I made a promise to you guys. And if that promise is true, she earned some rapport in my book. Yeah, I know. Like, big rapport. <laughs> 